Hey everyone, welcome to another mini video series where we are looking at 15th poet laureate in line that is John Masefield. He was born in 1878 in Hertfordshire, England. At an early age, his parents died and growing up, he was sent to sea abroad the school, the ship HMS Conway in preparation for a naval service. But soon he left the ship. Arrangements were made for him to join another ship in New York. But Maysville had other plans. He thought of writing. So his first volume of poetry called Salt Water Ballads was published in 1902. However, he made his mark on the literary scene with the publication of a narrative poem, The Everlasting Mercy, in 1911. The success of his second book was followed up by the publication of long narrative poems, including Dober in 1914 and Reynard the Fox in 1919. With the outbreak of war, Maysville became an attendant at the hospital in France. After failing there, Maysville visited the America and took a series of lectures in support of the war effort. In 1930, he was appointed poet laureate, and five years later, the much-loved Maysville was awarded the Order of Merit. He died on May 12, 1967, and his ashes were buried in Westminster Abbey. His the two K Hager books. The Midnight Folk of 1927 and The Box of Delights of 1935 are Maysville's lasting contribution to children's fantasy literature. The Box of Delight is now an established Christmas favorite and as much a part of the season of Dickens a Christmas carol. So, that's it for this video. To know more about poet laureates, keep in touch. Thank you. Thank you.